legends We spend all year waiting around for November 27th And you know it's a given Whether you're senior or freshman That you'll replay this game in your mind again and again So let's break it down The history of this rivalry They've been playing border battles since the 19th century With the Mesa Blue leading Winning 57 times Only 43 losses They remember six times But that was then This is now And ever since the Trestle came The Wolverines are beaten down So Lloyd Carr Said au revoir Then a coaching search started And it took the Mesa Blue far but now the Mountaineer's here, and he's finally got a quarterback, a defense has to fear. But even so, Rich Rod's lost more than not, and from where I'm standing, that seat looks pretty hot. As for Trestle, 10 years of scarlet fever, the man's got sweater vests that look as old as just a beaver. He's like a decade's worth of Buckeye for leaf clovers, but as for this year, the wait's almost over. The Scarlet and the Grey gonna tangle with the maize and blue this Saturday. So throw your hands up if you're feeling this a rhyme, as the BCS game on the line. The Scarlet and the Grey gonna tangle with the maize and blue this Saturday. Throw your hands up if you're feeling this around as the BCS game on the line. Ha, ha, have you ever seen a Wolverine? They're members of the Weasel family, muscular and lean. But like most information that's presented by the media, take it with a grain of salt and straight from Wikipedia. <laughs> Mind if I speak bluntly? You won't find two QBs more exciting in the country like Terrell Pryor. He moves as fast as fiber. When he came to Columbus, expectations couldn't be higher. But he keeps winning games, all the same, increasing his fame. Knowing when he loses, he bears all the blame and the shame. While at U of M, things were hard before the NARC. Now he's trying to rebuild a legacy that's recently charred. But now he's a star, getting accolades from afar. Because the touchdown runs have seemed to beat the NARC's coming and hard. here's to you, Mr. Robinson. Michigan loves you more than you will know. Now back to my flow. So what's on the line? State pride is the prize, man. A couple quarterbacks who one day just might win the highs, man. Yeah, I just struck the pose. And I'm dressed in border battle from my head down to my toes. Are you with me? You ready for this rivalry? Excited, cause you never know exactly what you might see. Now throw your hands up, tip a cup, you know what's up. Whether you love Brutus or you think that Buckeye's just nuts. The Scarlet and the Grey gonna tangle with the maize and blue this Saturday. So throw your hands up if you're feeling this around as the BCS game on the line. The Scarlet and the Grey gonna tangle with the maize and blue this Saturday. Throw your hands up if you're feeling this around as the BCS game on the line. There's no game as good in any other neighborhood. Oklahoma, Texas, I hope I misunderstood. Alabama, Auburn, that don't mean half as much. I need those other games like Nugent needs a hairbrush. The bottom line, there's no other game half as fine. On the Saturday, the college football stars align. Now it's almost time, the moments here, the teams are both prime. So ladies, sing me out with my colorful rhyme. The Scarlet and the Grey gonna tangle with the maize and blue this Saturday. So throw your hands up if you're feeling this around as the BCS game on the line. The Scarlet and the Grey gonna tangle with the maize and blue this Saturday. Throw your hands up if you're feeling this around as the BCS game on the line.